It can be a frustrating moment if your Wi-Fi is not working but the people around you are using it just fine. There can be a lot of reasons for it. Maybe there is some issue in your phone or maybe your iPhone or iPad cannot connect to this particular router. There can be a lot of reasons that might make you confused. All you need to do is to diagnose the real reason behind it. We are here to help you diagnose and fix this problem if your iPhone cannot connect to Wi-Fi. In this video, we are going to discuss different reasons and solutions for them to fix your Wi-Fi connectivity. First way. Reboot your iPhone. The first solution that comes to everyone's mind is to restart your phone whenever the Wi-Fi is not connecting to your iPhone. Sometimes a minor issue in connectivity can be resolved by just rebooting your device. Second way. Turn on and off the airplane mode. Another thing you can do is to turn on the airplane mode and then switch off it to see if your Wi-Fi is connecting to the router or not. This is an old trick that you can try out. Trust us, it works like magic. Third way. Delete corrupt Wi-Fi connections. There can be other complicated reasons why your Wi-Fi is not working. One of them the corrupt Wi-Fi networks on your iPhone. Sometimes we go to different places and connect to the Wi-Fi devices there and forget to delete even if we are not going to go there again. It is better to delete extra Wi-Fi networks from your phone as they might be causing the trouble. Fourth way. Make Wi-Fi stay connected on iPhone with a professional tool. The above methods are limited when there are some system or software issues on your iPhone. If everything above fails, do not hesitate to try to use F1 Geek iOS System Recovery to fix system issues on your iOS devices. This third-party tool is the best option when your iPhone won't stay connected to Wi-Fi for some iOS problems. It helps no matter you have newest device like iPhone 12 running the latest iOS 14 or the older devices with other iOS version.